All right, hey guys, um, back uh, for another round of uh, Far Cry Three. Uh, you might hear a little bit of background uh, noise in this uh, footage because playing through the TV again. And I don't know. I just like going back and forth. Uh, sometimes at night I, I put the headset on just so nobody wakes up. But uh, right now, it's, uh, did I get this tower? I don't know if it's saved or not. But yeah, I say beeping up there. So that's safe. Uh, so I think um, what I'm gonna do in this uh, probably set of clips is probably eventually make my way over to the quest area, but I wanna do like a few of these uh, huts or whatever. Yeah, the, Cause these give me like more uh, fast uh, travel options. And, oh, they're fun to do. So, let's get cracking. I found where that alarm is right there. I think that's the best way to take down the tower. So we do. <laughs> and also, I need like some ammo. So I might uh, take a small little cut here and get get a little refill on some shit. No fast travel points way over here, so uh, I'll try to get this tower clear, I guess, first. See the alarm. Uh, there's like a green little dot. So make my way over there. Then I'll be able to take everything down.
with the cops. That's actually tough. I'm probably like edit out some of the attempts, but um, I, I seen like a uh, cheetah in there, and figured I'd use that against him. It worked. Yeah. Yeah, let me switch out my weapons because run low in ammo.
I found like um, if they're all gonna go for alarm, just toss a grenade there. That's a good place to kill a lot of them if they're just gonna keep going that area. Ah, Mr. Cheetah. Thanks for the help, buddy. Sorry uh, you had to die there. Uh, they're gonna kill you anyway. At least they, you got some revenge on your captors. Oh, I guess that means uh, it's uh, synced up. Destroyed the crap out of this area. <laughs> I think if I just toss a grenade here, it blows it up, blows the alarm up too. Uh, I have to figure more of that out. It's uh, my little chest here. It was beautiful once, then it will be again. We can rebuild it. We can make it better. <laughs> okay. Uh, see on the radar, there's a chest in here, but how do I get in there? We have the outpost, but your work Come isn't on. done. Do this. Uh, okay. I just want to see if I can get the other ammo station. What the fuck? Me? Travelers, how do I get that thing? Something. I can't wait until this is home again. All right, get a little my ammo here, and then I'll head on towards the next area. Uh, looking up something and. Uh, on the internet, but just like in my menu, it says it's looking like these Path to Hunter quests with like the um, antlers and stuff is pretty good for like crafting. I'm not gonna do that right now. Get more places. I think that's a that's a good thing to do if you want want to do more crafting stuff. Uh, so maybe make my way north. I think now. Yeah. Or I'll probably get this radio tower to the. Right here. I'm not sure I'm gonna go this outpost first or not. But I could, because uh, it looks like there's a big river between there and that place. So let me go to this outpost here. Uh, set waypoint. We'll clear that out and then make my way up towards the um, the radio tower there. So, so I keep going. Okay, I'm going um, over here towards this outpost here. Um, I was um, looking at these Path to Hunter quests, and I, I think they're like probably good for like animal skins, um, duh, because it's got the land antlers and stuff. So. I think uh, if I wanted to get some more crafted stuff, I'll end up uh, clearing more of these outposts and get more of the Path to Hunter quests. But um, right now, that's all I'm going to focus on is try, try and get up to here, but I'm going to make a nice uh, U turn and try to clear everything on the way towards the objective. Oh shit. What the fuck? He, I, I seen that he like killed that guy. That's, ran him over or something. Okay. Anyways.
I'm trying to get this out place clear too. Uh, not too sure where these alarms are, but I'm seeing some speakers like right in front of me. So I think that's that might be like uh, where they could be. That's uh, I guess it makes sense to have the um, alarm there. But I thought they have like uh, internet access or something. I, don't, I guess they're too uh, primitive for that. So you just have little speakers going and have the alarm going like a. Siren. Uh, okay. it's, uh, this outpost doesn't look too tough, so I'm gonna probably just rainbow it. Let's, let's go to shot.
even stopped yet! That area is clear. Um, some reason why I turned my mic off on at the end there is messed up. Though. I don't know. Might just start leaving mic on with the TV. I think. Uh, but that's pretty cool. I didn't think they would invade the the beach here like Normandy. And that, I mean, this whole field right over here was like on fire. So. Uh, of course, there's grass or yeah, gas grass over there again. Gas grass. Yeah. <laughs> no, uh, live commentary. For yeah, that's that's pretty tense there. I think it'd be that tough, but I don't know, I'm thinking about just like not even worrying about the alarms anymore. Like this one is a little tougher because it had uh two alarms that see the one in the back here, so I'm thinking like when I evade these outposts I always look for the the green the lights up top. That's a sign for alarm because like I said they're primitive and they don't have like radios and shit to contact their crew members. So. Alright. Well. Anyways, uh, got that clear. I'm gonna head towards the radio tower here. Like I was saying, I'm slowly uh, heading towards the objectives now. Um, that way, I can try to get more of these outposts done. Um, I could like do more of the Pass to the Hunter quest, but uh, I don't know. I'll just uh, say this for later. I don't think they're gonna be that interesting. Of course, I do need some upgrades, uh, especially with like. My uh, ammo and shit. So. Okay, so let's head on up. <laughs> <laughs> 